Hey, here's Joe again, and welcome back to Thymesia, where we have done a lot of subquesting in this first region and still haven't visited the second region at all. But there's another one that we just unlocked. Uh, are we good on? Yeah, only 200 souls to lose. So no problems. Oda thinks these so-called monsters possess a greater power and vitality than humankind. They are the next stage in human evolution. We'll see. Mutated odor. <clears throat> the Twilight Circus's fame reaches far and wide and is often invited to tour other kingdoms. Upon its return to the Sea of Trees, the circus brings back foreign commodities as well as abundant job opportunities. Oh, can't use that one. Ah, we're here in the in-between section between the uh, other place and the boss. Okay. Same place. Here we go. Do we get a cutscene again? Yes. <laughs> oh, he just injected himself with the bullshit. And now he is only just realizing that that was a stupid idea. He has tentacles now. Um, what? Stop that. Okay, that was a weird thing where you glow before you attack. I might be able to foretell that in the future. Wow, that reach is ridiculous, but the deflection actually worked. That is an unblockable attack. That is super delayed. Oh, stupid. Hä? Hey, where was the heal after I pressed it? Death can do nothing to stop evolution. Yeah, I, I hate that. Uh, there is no voice lines. That doesn't help. Okay, let's go in. Give me time to attack you. His other attack comes in before I can claw to deflect damage. Uh. Okay, you can also do that point blank. That is not only a ranged attack. Yep. Yeah. Okay, that has barely any tell. Okay, I messed up the timing this time on that one. But you can deflect that, actually. Okay, I am not good at timing the step ramp. That I'm not even sure I deflected that. I deflected an AoE attack. Oh, I'm out of here. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Okay, okay. We'll get destroyed a lot. That's just the way it goes. Do I have the thing in my current talent? 
I do. Okay. It's good to know that I have it there. We could try to go for more timely deflect stuff and stuff. Whatever. Let's just go in. Let's just assume that whatever loadout we have is fine. I didn't pick up my souls the first time, so uh, that's zero there. Memory is so. Do not. I tried to step jump. There is. After that attack, there's. After that attack. Two times in a row, I got hit by a combo. And his combo was over. That was the finish attack, the last attack of the combo. And I, between that and the next combo, I didn't have time to heal. Good that I'm not using that long-lasting potion, because with that one I would be screwed, because you never get it off in this fight. <laughs> and yes, I'm... trying to time it better. Uh, okay, I was animation priority there. Hello! Hello? Bigger windows for... It's supposed to give me... Oh god, it's... Uh, hello? Reach? Okay, that is the one that I... Uh... Hello? Oh my god. Hello? Buttons! I press you! It's okay if I miss time the deflect. What the fuck? That was supposed to be a step jump, but I apparently I pressed right, although I didn't. Hello. Sometimes he just doesn't do the attack. No, he is. Can't do anything about that attack because the second and the fourth one are unblockable. Because uh, if you block the first one, there's no time to block the second one. Deflect, whatever. So sometimes when I just say hello, that is because I pressed left bumper and my character got hit without doing an animation. I mean, if I mistime it, no problem. But please give me... Uh, Give me the signal that you understood that I pressed the button. I mean, yes, I'm bad, I'm bad, I'm bad, I'm bad. Uh, that should have been the right timing. That too, that too, that too. That was four attacks in a row where the deflection doesn't work. Okay. I press deflect before the attack hits me. Like 0 0.2 seconds before or something like that. And just, it just isn't the right timing. Yeah, but when do I press it then? <laughs> like, what, at what other timing do I press it? <laughs> like, I can't press it after the attack. And there's no sign of any attack. Now I was spamming. Now I was trapped in a claw again. Wow. Hey! Hey! Okay. No spamming. Okay. That was wrong. And he healed. Great. Okay, got two deflects in there. 
Hä? Huh? That timing shit. Oh, I have no ears anymore. Why do I do that every time? Uh, I'm screwing up everything. Okay. We need to think about how I play this game because I'm playing wrong. Okay. First thing to stop me from playing the game wrong is getting rid of this stupidity here. Increase deflect timing. Bam. Just make it more precise. Also allows me to, to block, uh, uh, to deflect a crit. Okay. Good. So this should up my damage if I time it right and should give me a better impression on how on how and when to press the button. Hello! Here! Sometimes I can press... Deflect twice or thrice. Before he attacks. Although his attack was weird. Up. Before I started pressing deflect. Hello? <laughs> what is that? I delete you now from 30 meter away. Here, have a four combo attack that you def don't deflect, although you press the button at the right time. Roughly the right time, not the right time, but I press the buttons. <laughs> like it if I miss the first one, I should be able, if I spam, to get automatically the second deflect. <laughs> Take my input! What is that attack? Yeah. Oh, it's that attack. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I screwed up that timing. Okay, my timing is not... I tried to jump! What the fuck is wrong with me? That's not Elden Ring. I cannot jump. Huh? When did I put in that button press? Like, yes, I'm screwing up the timings of everything, but I didn't press right bumper there. Oh, I'm out of... Great. Okay. Great. I'm stupid! Got him below half. Wow, that was too early. Okay. I did it twice and the second one was still too early. Yes, I'm spamming. I know, I know. I never learned to properly deflect. I know. I was better in Sekiro at that at the end, after my second playthrough. <clears throat> so I sh there should be some place in my head that has the the muscle memory for that. What? When do I press the claw? 
When do I press claw if not then? Huh? What's that reach? That's ridiculous. Huh? Okay, don't spam there. Don't spam there. Can't get two in, that's stupid. I hate it. There's no time to get a claw in. It heals everything. <gasps> when do I press left trigger there? And how was that not timed well? How was that not timed well? Huh? How was that not the step jump? Okay. When do I press left trigger there? Yep, and that's my death. Yep, that's my death, because the starting attack of this combo I have to spam, because if I wait till I see which attack he does, there's no human possibly, uh, human possible timing to deflect that attack, because it can either be delayed, the delayed tentacle or the uh, non-delayed other attack. <laughs> Like hand claw, whatever he is using the stick. When do I claw him? That is the end of. That is the finish of his combo. If I punish the finish of his combo, that should be the perfect timing to claw him. Directly after. What? What is that? What is that? What is that? That was three times the perfect timing. You... There is no way to press earlier. There's no way to press later. What the timings? Yes, how do... What part timing do you want me to press the buttons? Like, I can't even get the boss 10% health down now. That was the right timing before. You can't punish that, Joe. You know that. And you cannot deflect a first attack of a combo because you don't know which one's coming. Like you can string every combo into every combo, I think, with the tentacles and the and the uh, kicks and the uh, and the cane. He can string every combo into every combo and start out with everything. So that was not. The right delay? Okay, that is the one that I claw. What the fuck? And I'm dead. And I'm dead! The best, the fastest here takes five seconds. His furthest delay between two attack combos is two seconds. What? Why? We'll get better at this. He's not that bad. He's not that bad. We got him down to below 50%, so he should be beatable. How is that still too early? How was that not a perfectly timed step jump? Fuck it, game. What the fuck? That was early. Okay. 
How was that early? Do I have to press after the attack or what? Okay, that attack just hits me four times now. Why did I press? Oh, I deflected it. Fucking delays on your attacks. What the? Okay. We use our last heal. He's just 10% down. Great. How is that not the right timing? Yeah. There is no way to claw him down. He has no claw opportunities. He has enough opportunities to damage his health bar, his, his white health bar. But there is no claw damage opportunities. It's already 20 minutes, my god. Didn't feel like 20. <laughs> I can't do anything. If I'm locked into an attack, I can't do anything. If I'm blocked against the wall, I can't see anything. Uh, that is... Okay, he can do the critical or the non-critical attack in that combo. That's the one that I want to punish. What? What was that? You do your shit over there. change on the same attack here huh? man. Your reach is ridiculous. Okay, if I don't connect it with him during the reflect that breaks this AoE, then I don't get uh, claw damage in. What the fuck? Then I don't, don't get uh, claw afterwards. You kidding me? What the fuck? You can... Oh, uh, he can po still point blank range the four hit step attack that just kills you because you can't deflect it. You can deflect it with the other timings, but then you get less damage in because all my damage comes from deflects now. Hello. And this. Okay. Okay. I'm now more confident with the deflect timings, and the extra timing will help. Now I shouldn't get hit anymore by anything. How was that too early? Like, how delayed can you do that attack? How oh, delayed is that attack? Reach everywhere, man. What? He missed me. How helpful. That really helps with finding a way to fight him if he fucking misses me all of a sudden. Hey, thank you for not dodging, man. Hey. 
Huh? What was that direction on that dog? Shank, thank you for... Thank you for eating my step and jump. Uh. That was also a good timing. That was also a good timing. Thank you for eating his health away for me there. Game. He completely replenished his health because you just... That was a good timing. That had been a good timing before. Eh? Okay, I hate that. Oh god. That's his finisher. Ultimate it was called. Okay. Yeah, okay, he made his ultimate into AoE. Yeah, that's fair. I didn't know what was going on. Because I didn't know uh, that uh, him pulling off his ultimate, that is the red attack, the one that cannot be any... It, you can't do anything against that attack other than completely evade the range. Uh, at least that was how it was introduced. I didn't know that that would unlock me and I was super confused when it was still the cineastic camera angle. Okay. How I have, however, I missed that. Your range is ridiculous on some of your attacks. Okay. Okay. Half health transformation attack it is. Okay, we can... Lock on while that's the I didn't want to put in a direction you just assumed I wanted why is it that humans fear with which is new I have no idea stop distracting me from the boss fight with having to look at the bottom of the screen because that's a good idea Okay. Good. We went further in with uh, now that I'm more used to the timing and now I have a more lenient timing thing there. I still have no idea what to do with this half health critical attack. Other than maybe to sheath him from the distance using the feathers into uh, him missing it because I'm not even there when he starts it.
What the fuck? Why did I press any directions even? I shouldn't press directions. I should let him come to me. I should only press directions. Hey, it ate my input. Thank you. When he does this. Oh, that's not the thing that I thought he would do. That one. Then I should press directions. Thank you for not taking my direction input there, game. That was face transformation already. Should come soon, though. It. Okay, that range is not. As ridiculous as I thought. He does weird. Yeah, just to move when he doesn't do shit. Oh, that is him doing shit? That looked more like him escaping. I should get the upgrade that lets me in the air in a claw attack. Yeah, that is the attack that I can normally... Uh, that I can normally... count him on, but not if he managed to uh, shut me down, uh, to knock me down. Okay. What do I not want right now? Probably luck. Instead, we gain... First aid? That also helps in this boss fight. I uh, want the claw, gliding claw. Gliding claw and also what else don't we need that we don't need? Both damage type. Okay. Both both damage types when it from inner attacks. Okay. And now go to skip. <laughs> Press a tiny bit forward until the first interaction
Okay. Hello! Dodges should count. Never press that button game, man. You ate... You ate damage there, game. Because you thought I pressed that button. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't touch that side of the, the face buttons of the control... Ah, uh, shit. Big pedal stuff. Elite controller bullshit. Oh, yes. Fuck that. Okay, you have to delay your input there because sometimes he just eats it. Otherwise, or you have to mash the input there. Heal up in case he hits me with the ultimate. Fuck you. Oh no, that's not the ultimate yet. Ah, great. enough in to be worth it. That's the super delayed one. To get a claw in. Need to get a claw in. Now I can. <laughs> he deleted me because he just decided to not count my deflects. That, my friends, by the way, was a almost 10 minute try. Great. It went down to screwing up one time like the deflect timing one time at the end there which led to four hits because if you miss the first one you get perma damage uh, you perma not damage Was good timing, man. Ah, fuck you. Press the button. Hey, great. Thank you for putting in directional inputs that I didn't put in, game. 
If I don't hold any direction on the stick, you're not supposed to move a direction during that dodge. Fuck you, game. That was the right timing! That was the right timing! just dip his face transition because it was the voice line of it. Can be any time now, yeah. Okay. okay, I'm way behind. That's not what I should do to punish there. Now I can do that. Fuck you. Ah uh, yes, you fuckhead! Decide to delete me! Decide to delete me! Why are you changing your timings? That was the perfect time. That was a perfect time deflect. Thank you. Now, it was not perfectly timed, obviously, but sometimes I'm not certain whether my controller just didn't accept my input or whether the uh, whether I was off time. And I'm not certain with this broken controller. And that's really pissing me off. <laughs> Fuck you! Should I restart now? Let's restart the attempt now. It ate, ate two inputs. Like, it ate one input uh, where it didn't deflect and then it dodged diagonal around him. Although uh, that was not what uh, the stick told him to do. I need more water. After this attempt I'm getting more water. Can you please run? <laughs> Deliberately wasting my time going on. Yeah, it was too early. It was stupid. Yeah, it was super stupid. Where's your transition attack? No? I think I stamped him out of the... He has a certain range where he can do that attack and I just uh, managed to skip it.
Okay, ist nett in der AI los. Fuck. I thought so, but it wasn't. Fuck you, game. You ate that step jump. You ate, ate that deflect. You almost ate that heal. Stuff. Tentacles, huh? Nice. Mutated odor score and a forgotten feather. And more mutated tentacle skill shards. The curtain will soon fall for humanity and a new show will begin, he says. Nah, the curtain fell for you, man. Is this all that has happened? Yes. Okay, uh, how are we timing wise? Yeah, that's okay. Then let's talk to her about the item. First of all, that was it with the Sea of Trees. Good to know. Show the fused core. Odo has already become obsessed with alchemy research. It's clear from experiment number one that a mixture of pure blood and vile blood within an organism will produce uncontrollable mutations. What's incomparable power when you look so terrifying? Okay, then we can go to the bacon menu. Level up to one times only. Okay, vitality. I want the 10 vitality for the boosts to the different weapons. Um, but now we need other stuff. That one goes away. Which others did I take away that I need normally? Luck. I just take away luck. Two points into luck. Where else can I nap a point? Gliding claw. We're gonna take the claw level 2 away for exploration's sake. But the claw still has an option. Now that I know how to step jump every second time or every third time, the problem is like it it's so easy for the game to detect a directional input that I didn't mean. Grow chain clickers on the back and do a three combo attack and a smash attack. So four hits. Two and a two and a, so four and a four and that's a good amount of damage. But we need twenty vitality to make it worthwhile. What's the extended action? Press X before the smash attack to cast again. So the triple, uh, uh, the triple attack can be cast repeatedly. So like three, 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 and then the smash. That's really good. Did we get another potion upgrade? Stuff. Uh, this almost here's to full. That's why we want, wanted to wait. Yes. Okay. Good. I just remembered that I should look at this every now and then to see when it opens. And we had an experiment report show up here. Maybe it didn't show up though. Maybe it was there in that corner that I just saw from the beginning and just during my first run through uh, of the area I didn't recognize it. We'll see after we defeat the first boss of the second region which we will start with in the next episode, but what we're still doing this episode is going back to meet Emerald again. So we are going here and I'm skipping you to Emerald. So see you in a second. Okay, and we arrived at Emerald's place. Do you have something you have to ask? No, not while standing inside you. This is a way better angle. Okay, a lot.
this is the one that was in the courtyard of the hub. The transformed are so interesting and are such challenging research material. Using the infected as carriers, we use alchemy to grant them new life. A very interesting concept, though interspecies fusion was required and that was no easy, easy task. The successful cases were few and far between. Corvus, you were one of the lucky few. Okay, I am one of those experiments, okay. Upon discovering that giant trees could absorb the plague, we began to go in an entirely new direction. But no matter what we tried, the human body always rejected lifeless foreign objects. In serious cases, fatal antibodies would even be produced. So we began to experiment on animals. The results were fantastic. There are many animals that can increase resistance to the plague. Then I thought, why not take a mixture of cells from both the so-called sacred trees and animals and implant them into a human body? That's how he came up with the mutated thing. Okay. So let then tell me about the big, the god, the god of the fools. Magnificent, a masterpiece of masterpieces. Such complicated technology and for audio, to such to use it on such a massive structure. It's such a pity you destroyed it. I'm simply dying to know how Oda managed to take to make a lifeless body move like that. Who are you even? That you feel like the bad guy. Oda's understanding of alchemy is absolutely exceptional. Though some say there's a fine line between genius and insanity, but I believe he merely sees the truth, the reality that others cannot comprehend. Looks like I have come to the right place. Can't ask anything else. I uh, wanted to look at... Not story items. Here. Law. We're like halfway done with law already. With these things. But it almost looks like we missed something in the beginning. Like in one of the earlier levels. Maybe uh, we will be returned to the... Yeah, this is the one that's in the hub. So this could also spawn in the hub, but later. Maybe this is the final boss that we fight in the hub. Ace me or Emerald. So we have to do two playthroughs to speak to either of them, the surviving one. Maybe. If that's like my choice at the end. That would be that would not be not be bad. And we wanted to look at how far we are through this. More than a third. Okay. Good. Then let find me a way to uh, see his recall. And yeah. Think I'm gonna level vitality with all the uh, memory stuff we just found. We needed like 6k something. So let's use my 1800, no, my 4500 here. Let's use 4,000, because I wasn't sure. Okay, we can use one more. We can use the last one. And let's look up how much we need. Uh, exactly 10. We should have enough of those, yeah. I picked up all the law in the beginning. Meaning there's less lore to find now. Okay, level up. Vitality again. So now some of the plague weapons get extra stuff. Okay, what else did we want? Energy restoring by blocking. I don't use my sub weapons, so no. Dodging gives buff. Big recovery gives buff. It's not good. Energy restored is nothing that we use. Gliding Claw is very situational. Super armor when performing a Predator's Claw is, is a thing. I mean, uh, when do I use it? I don't use the sub-weapons. Does the intercept wing work from a distance though, like the feather? Okay, we use two feathers to come closer to the enemy. Okay, that resets the feather. Intercept 
thing just sounds so good here. But the other thing is so good too. That we the, the step and jump. So probably looking here. And this would be great, but the first two blessings are not that great. Don't need that. Maybe just this for convenience sake. But I don't I really only need it at boss fights like older. So I don't need anything. So if I don't need anything, we're going for intercept wing next. Which we use by there it was! I was searching for that. When successfully interrupting a critical attack with a feather dart, gain a stack of predator swiftness buff, greatly increasing the charge speed of your next predator's claw. The great thing about that is, when we use uh, intercept wing, that doesn't work anymore because it's not feather dart. Like this could transforms my attack, so this point is useless later. Okay. I was searching for that. I didn't find it again. Okay, whatever. Seize recall. Okay, so tomorrow we're gonna visit the second place for the first time. I'm actually super interested. Is the door open now? No, it's the other door. Okay. Royal Guard. Tomorrow we'll be visiting. Visiting, not visiting. It's not a W, it's a V. The problem is that German pronunciation of V and W is totally different. And thus there's some false friends and that's why I'm saying visiting with the W. Just because that's kind of how the V is pronounced in German. Kind of. Because with none of those sounds exactly like you use it. So it's a, it's a bit weird. Okay. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. We. We. Will be visiting the Royal Gardens. Have a nice day.